So the midterms are coming up, as we were talking about earlier. Um, what is it US citizens really want? What is it US citizens really need? Is it air, food, free Medicare for all? Is that is is it that fundamental now? Well, what I think the anger and, and what led to the insurgencies in the two political parties is this grotesque social inequality and, and economic stagnation and decline that has now beset the majority of the country. Uh, but of course, neither of the parties are going to address that issue because, mm -hmm. of course, they orchestrated it. And, uh, and so you get the whole phantom driven by the Democratic Party that Russia stole the elections. Somehow Trump was elected because of Russian bots, uh, which is crazy. I mean, it's nuts. It, it has no basis in reality. Uh, but the, the, the stark reality, the reason that there is so much uh, anger and legitimate anger through rippling throughout the country, um, they're not going to address. Um, because if they had to address it, they'd have to begin to correct it. And they have no intention of correcting it. Uh, and so what we're watching now is a kind of naked kleptocracy, not only a personal kleptocracy for the Trump family, uh, but a kleptocracy for corporate power. Uh, which is just looting, stealing, drilling, pillaging uh, with wild abandon. I mean, this tax cut that they just passed last year, uh, which, you know, compounds our deficits and um, in, in essence legalizes a tax boycott at this point for large corporations. It, it, it's just, it, it's raw. And so what you'll see as things continue to devolve is an attempt by Trump and the Republican Party uh, to essentially further stoke the racism and the hatred, the xenophobia against Muslims, against undocumented workers, against African Americans, um, as a way to cover for uh, this unimpeded theft, pillage, looting that is now taking place under the Trump administration. Not that it didn't take place under past administrations, but now there are just no constraints, no restrictions at all.